to another Fish with Bryson video. Today I'm doing my top 10 favorite hard baits. I did my favorite, my top 10 favorite soft plastic baits a couple days ago, but now I'm doing the hard baits. Um, I'm, as you guys saw probably on Monday, you saw me film my top 10 favorite rods. I'm filming that to say I'm filming them. I'm filming this video on Monday. I just filmed the um, top 10 favorite rods a couple of minutes ago. Now I'm doing my top, I'm just grinding out videos this, these past two weeks for you guys. Um, but, cause it's almost summer, school's almost out, have some end of, end of year testing, so I'm not going to do any videos next week or the following week, so that's why I'm filming a lot of videos this week. I'm not doing any videos that week, cause it's school testing. I'm sorry I'm not doing any, because I have testing. I need to, um, concentrate on that. Um... So, sorry, my, my camera just said full battery. So we're going to start off with my top 10, or no, this is going to be my top 7 favorite baits. Or, it might turn out to a top 10, it's between 7 and, seven and 10. Okay, so my top, or here, so my... I need to figure out how many um, um, baits I'm doing here. Probably gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, this is my top seven favorite baits. So here's my top seven. It's a jerk bait. This is the Berkeley 110 cutter. I don't remember the color I've had this for a long time. You guys can definitely see the battle wounds on this little dude. Bite mark there, bite mark at the bottom hooks bite mark there bite mark another bite mark this thing is tore up you can definitely see that this thing has definitely caught a lot of fish especially last fall this thing was getting eaten up especially past couple of days actually surprisingly in April I've been getting hand jerk baits or in May too so there's a jerk bait that's my favorite jerk bait it's a Berkeley 110 color this color here I'll zoom in on it so you guys can see it has a chartreuse bottom, kind of like a sexy shad-ish, black top, boom, that's it. Berkeley 110 cutter, have them at Bass Pro. Okay, so there's that. Okay, so my next bait, my number six favorite bait is the Rapal, my, the Rapala SR5. These are balsal wood lures. They're very, fairly cheap. Made by Rapala, or Rapala, Rapala, however you say it. Um, this is the baby bass cut. I've actually been getting eaten on this lure by bass, cannibal bass. Um, right there. Um, also, I don't have. I threw it away because it broke yesterday. But I have the bigger version. That's our seven. Um, it's the perch color. It's a yellow perch. And like normally, we don't have yellow perch. We have white perch. But the bass seem to love the yellow perch color. And normally, this is my. This is the bay I caught my first bass ever on. Not the seven. The five. <laughs> Um, but there's that. I love, love that color. Also, my dad's been killing fish on this bluegill color SR7, but he's been using SR5. I just don't have any. He broke them all. Um, he's been catching cannibal bluegills too on this and a lot of bass. Um, SR5 is a great lure, so it depends on what year you're in or what time of year. Right now, panfish kind of colors are they're eating, and surprisingly, baby bass colors. But other times of the year, they're, they're wanting shad colors. Right now, they're wanting bluegill because they're protecting fry where I live. Okay, so there's that bait. Now, is there anything in there? I want to show. Okay, this is going to be an, this is an honorable, honorable mention. It's not in the top ten, but it's this color clickbait. It, with that color dark... Guggen Squad Dart Trailer and a Guggen Squad 
um, clickbait. I've only caught one fish on it, but it was a giant pike, or slash chain pickerel. I'm not a giant fan of, like, chatterbait style things, but I just, letting you guys know, down in the intercoastal, I think you guys saw, you saw on that one video I filmed, um, has a frog thumbnail with a bass, I'm holding the frog with the bass, um, but you saw that picker on there, it was on this bait, it's exactly with this, it's the same exact trailer, this is the trailer that they hit, surprised they didn't get tore up from all the teeth, um, but, yeah, that's an honorable mention. That's it, I've only, I've only caught like three fish ever on a chatterbait. Okay, so, there's our honorable mention. Um, anything in here I need to show. Here's another honorable mention. I haven't caught a fish on it yet, but it looks so juicy in the water. It's a Guggen Squad Contender. This is the 4.5 inch Contender. But they make a 7 that is way too big for like Norman. This is probably a little too big for Norman. You're only catch the big ones on this in Norman. Um, but that's not, I've never caught a fish on it. But this thing looks so juicy in the water. It's ridiculous. It literally, this looks like a fish swimming. It's so juicy in the water. I've had a, three blow ups on it. Because it kind of swims near the top. Kind of more subsurface, surface-ish. Well, well, when you put on the right gear ratio, like a uh, um, six, that's what I was using on yesterday. Um, it was actually kind of swimming down deeper a little bit. I was I was using on a seven, and I was just bring it or on an on an eight. Then I was bringing across the surface, and I went to a seven, kind of in the middle. Six is the best because it's down there, going kind of slow. That's another honorable mention right there. So my next favorite baits are the, um, where is it, there it is, a square bill. This is the Guggen Squad, um, banger, it's a sexy shad color, um, any square bill, it just depends on what brand you want, same with all these other baits, whatever brand you, rec whatever brand you like. Um, and also my next bait, I don't even know, I don't, I'm just not even going to number this. I'm just, I'm going to go through after I'm done and so I want to go to edit this. I'm going to count how many baits I have in there and that's what I'm going to name it, title it. So my not, my next bait is a frog. Multiple different types of popping frog, uh, normal frog, colors, frogs. We don't usually catch them up here in Norman on frogs. We, we've never caught a fish in Norman on a frog. But down in the intercoastal, right now, they're killing frogs. They're loving frogs. Nope. Don't care. Just whatever brand you guys want to use. These, this is the Strike King Poppin' Perch. And this is the... Uh, uh, what is it? The um, Jawbone. The... Uh, the um, Dick's brand. Dick's Sporting Goods brand. Yeah, so there's the next favorite bait. Um, and also, okay, so my, I know this is my favorite bait of all time. In fact, I have a whole box of it. Are rattle trap, clipless crankbaits. I like the, the Guggen clutches. This is the mini clutch. This is the normal clutch. Sexy Shad, don't remember this color, but it kind of has a chartreuse bottom white, gray top with those kind of sparkly dudes on it. And then this is Sexy Shad. Sexy Shad is my favorite color out of them all. Um, also, I have like Jinko style. I have bluegill color. This is Ghost Skill and Googling Clutches. I was getting, I was getting eaten on this thing a couple, like yesterday. Get eaten on this thing, or I wasn't. Had one on, had multiple come up for I saw. Um, had a ton of hits on this though. There's a lot of interest, I should say. A lot of interest. That's another clutch. You guys also probably saw the video of me reviewing the Strike King Red Eye Shad bait. I haven't caught a thing on it yet, but it's juicy looking in the water. Sounds nice. 
and also have her polar jerk, raffle jerk bait, or not jerk bait, rattle traps. Have rat L trap brand right here. Um, have Jinko brand. Ouch. Hooks are sharp. Um, more Shrike King. This is a Lure Candy brand. Never thrown this before. Have another Rappel of Color. Or another Rappel of Jerk Bait. Rattle Trap, not Jerk Baits. Why am I keep saying Jerk Baits? But yeah, there's my favorite hard baits. This was probably a shorter video. But there's my favorite hard baits. Um, so guys. Hey, I'm gonna lock this compartment. Come on. Get in there. There we go. Okay, guys, so thanks for watching. DM me on Instagram for any video ideas because YouTube turned off comments. But make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, and my Instagram's at Fish with Bryce and L. You'll see in the end video. But make sure you subscribe, hit the like button, and peace out.